I can kind of estimate which topics are more um, important to people by the number of questions that are repeated. Okay, I like, I like this one too. Um, succulents, too much water, too little water, I just don't understand. Plants do not work by water alone. Plants need to be in front of the place that will have the best possible light. The only place for that to happen indoors, especially for succulents, is right in front of a very large window, plus two or three hours of sun would be great as well. Generally, step one, light. You must put the plant right in front of the window. And then, number two, you need to water according to the strategy of succulents. And just a few minutes ago, I said that there are only three different ways to water a plant, which is you keep the soil evenly moist, you water when it's partially dry, or you water when it's totally dry. And for a succulent, the strategy is water when totally dry. So given that your plant is sitting in front of the window, then you will not water again until the soil is totally dry. And then when you water, you are trying to soak all of the soil completely nice and evenly and let all the extra water drain away. So there's my succulent. Like this little succulent, this little Haworthia here, the soil right now is totally, totally dry, but I know that the plant still has water all stored in these leaves. For, for this plant, I can actually just gently pinch the, the leaves and when they are slightly not as firm as they were before, then I just water, I water the plant. And when I water, as I said earlier, you water until it's all totally nice and, and soaked and then let the extra water drain away and then make sure you put it back in front of the window. So I'm just gonna take a guess as to why this person doesn't understand. My guess is that they have put the plant far from the window, maybe like on their desk somewhere. Somewhere where I measure the light and it's gonna be like, I don't know, 20 foot candles. And then they're told, oh, water the plant once a week. Well, you're watering it when the soil is probably still wet. And after several weeks, the plant just rots and dies. So then you, you go and look up some more advice and then they say for succulents, it's actually much longer between. In fact, you should wait until the soil is completely dry. Like that's one part of what I just said, which is water when the soil is totally dry. But they still put the plant on the desk where the foot candle reading is like 20 to 50 foot candles. And that's not, that's not dark. It's still like under a, under a fluorescent, uh, sorry, under artificial lights where it's well lit enough for you to read that could be 50 foot candles, but that is not enough for a succulent. So anyway, you put the succulent there. Now you're waiting until the soil is totally dry. And let's say now that takes three weeks. So three weeks time goes by every three weeks goes by. And eventually the plant still rots and dies. The, the critical thing is that that plant did not have the right light in order for it to do its work. The only way for a plant, for the only way to quote unquote properly water uh, the plant is to put the plant right in front of your biggest possible window. And that's not to say that everything's gonna be fine and dandy. It means the best possible, like your plant will only grow as good as your windows. And unfortunately, I'm just gonna say it, Unfortunately, the interior space of most places is like a cave. It's not like a forest because a forest, the, the trees don't block out the sky above you. Like it's like kind of like translucent. Whereas your ceiling and your walls are opaque. Nothing gets through. Anyway, so hopefully that answers the question. It's all about light. Start with light and then watering will be fine.